Well, hungry vegans targeted Big Ben today, spraying white paint outside the House of Parliament ahead of Liz Truss's first Prime Minister's questions. The Animal Rebellion protest group says the white paint symbolises milk and was intended to represent the destruction of a dairy industry. Also represents, of course, petulant vandalism and the destruction of a historic building. It's the fourth day of action from the group. They've also cleared milk from the shelves of supermarkets in four different cities. They say they're aiming to force Liz Truss to the negotiating table, but are they, in fact just annoying the hell out of all of us. Well, joining me now is a spokesman for Animal Rebellion, Orla Coughlin, who was at the protest at Big Ben earlier uh, today. Uh, good evening to you. Thanks so much for having me. Why would chucking paint all over Big Ben persuade someone like me to give up meat? <laughs> OK, yeah. look, that's all fine. That wasn't my question. My question is, why does chucking paint over Big Ben why does desecrating Trafalgar Square with red dye, chucking milk around Harrods, destroying supermarket shelves and so on, how does that persuade me, who already likes eating meat, why are you going to persuade me by being a vandal? Don't get it. Right? I'm a meat eater. Why can't we just both live happily in each other's orbit? Why can't you let me just get on with eating meat and you eat your gruel and we're all go home happy? Because we know animal farming and fishing are a leading cause of the climate crisis. And we know having a strictly vegan diet is bad for you as well. Well, that's not true. A lot of science says it's bad for you. That's not true. It is true. No, the, what the, do you eat? I eat... Uh, do you eat almonds? Almond, do you drink almond milk? Eat almonds? I think you're digressing from the, the, I'm big, sorry, question. the big issue I'm just here. curious what you eat. Do you eat almonds? I'm here to talk about the climate crisis. <laughs> I eat a plant-based diet. Do you eat avocados? I'm asking the government... Do you eat avocados? Yes? A leading study from... Do you... It's, look, it's, it's an interview. You don't just answer different questions. Do you eat avocados? I eat a plant-based diet, which do is... Do you eat avocados? <laughs> yes. Yes, you do. Great. Do you know how avocados and almonds get made? Absolutely. You do? Yes. Do you realise that in California, every year, for six weeks, they fly in billions of bees to create your almonds and avocados, and in that process, several billion bees get murdered? No, anyway, look, I'm starving, it. and... Uh, you're not going to persuade me. And my response to you destroying all these things is to have a Big Mac. Because you know what? It's a free country, it's a democracy, and I'm allowed to eat meat, and I'm certainly allowed to eat meat when someone who kills bees to feed their avocado habit minds. What we're asking is for the government to support.